Hey everyone, welcome to On Top with T. I am the real Lady T1237, honey, and I am back today on this Sunday with another one. I hope all my beautiful subscribers and everybody like wishes in the bushes, all y'all, hope everyone is having a wonderful Sunday. I am just having a good one. It is Sunday evening. I said, let me come on real quick, honey, while I'm pretty sure y'all still up, honey, and, and waiting for me. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you so much. But anyway, honey, I'm here to do some reporting because that's what I do. Okay, now let's get into it. Okay, you guys, child, I know y'all been sitting back watching this Ooh, honey, this excursion, this gal here is on, honey, over in Hawaii, honey, Lily. She's over in Hawaii, yeah, child. Oahu, Waikiki. She didn't say they was in Waikiki. Now, I told y'all, y'all, a couple of weeks ago, I said, if the girl go to the island, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to roast her. I told y'all that. I said, if she go to this certain island, I'm going to roast her. Y'all, I'm here to roast her. No, I ain't going to roast her. But I am going to say, I knew she was going to go there, you guys. I really did. And let me tell you why. Waikiki, Oahu is the cheapest island that you could possibly go on. But you know what? I'm not going to say nothing about it, y'all. It's Sunday. I'm going to be nice, child. I'm going to try to be a little nice, nasty today. That's what she used to call it. She said, I try to be nice, nasty. So I'm going to be a little nice, nasty. But uh, Wa Waikiki, okay, is a tourist island, okay? It's a tourist island. But I knew that was going to be the island that they picked to go to because that is the island everybody usually picks to go to their first trip to Hawaii. Um, they haven't been anywhere. They've never been anywhere. As we can see, this is their first real uh, trip out of California. Um, and it's good. It's good that she took her family to go see, you know, a nice little adventure and all of that there. That's really sweet. It's so sweet of you chopping to do so. Um, but I mean, if you're not just in my opinion, if you're not island hopping, uh, me and my husband, we island hopped. We went from Maui uh, back over here to uh, Waikiki. And uh, it's so many islands there, so many other islands in Hawaii that you can go to. But uh, we basically um, kind of stayed over in Maui. Maui is the place. Maui is, if you're going to go, you guys, and you're not really... Uh, you kind of just want to uh, jump into it and not really get your feet wet. Because like I said, Oahu, uh, Waikiki is a place where you go. Well, Waikiki actually is a neighborhood that's in Oahu, which is in Honolulu, Hawaii. Um, I would say going there to Oahu is a tourist destination. That's where everybody goes your first time. But if you don't want to go straight to Maui, I just suggest everybody go straight to Maui. Maui have so many other fun things to do. Maui have the Ocean Center Aquarium uh, there. Um, it has uh, it, a beautiful sunsets, you guys. Absolutely. Now, if you want a beautiful sunset, Go to Maui, okay? The best. <clears throat> Excuse me, not that many people. Uh, it's not gonna. Well, it is. It's that. Well, I take that back. It's it's a lot of people on all the islands because it's Hawaii. Um, because everybody know about you know everybody knows about different islands. Now, just because you don't know, don't mean the next person don't know. You understand what I'm saying? So it's uh, Hawaii is just gonna be everywhere you go. The islands are gonna be you know uh uh busy. But Waikiki is, the, I mean, but Oahu is the busiest because it's a tourist attraction. And it's like I said, the first place that you go to get your feet wet. Now, this picture here you guys are looking at is me and my husband's uh, trip over to uh, Hawaii. And this was at, this here was in Oahu. And this is the early circa years of uh, 1990s. Um, we went and we had a good time. Like I said, we island hot. We went from here mm -hmm. to Maui. And um, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful place. It's just another picture I just thought I would show you guys. But anyway, I don't know these people here sitting here. So I just, I'm just taking a picture, child. I'll just, I just, like I said, when I went and it was my first time going here to uh, Waki, um, 
to Oahu, like I say, it was my first time. So you wanted to, you take pictures of anything. Child, you will just take pictures of uh, the sign and say mahalo. You will take pictures of Duke's, Duke's Beach, of the uh, surfboard and get on each side and take pictures with that. You know, it was just like we did so many things that some people would say, oh my goodness. Oh, they're first timers. Oh, they're tourists. You know, we did the tourist thing. But as time went on and we went back and back, we went to Maui. And Maui was absolutely gorgeous. Like I say, uh, maybe I'll share some, I don't know, later on. But you know, I'm not the one that come on and brag and do all that kind of stuff. But anyway, I just thought that I would show her that she wasn't the only one shit that done been the damn Oahu. Like I say, child, that's the cheapest damn island on the damn map in Hawaii. But anyway, that's neither near nor there. And I ain't going to put a little trip down because it was for a birthday and that was good. But yes, I am. And you know why, y'all? Because I am here to get into her behind because she knew better taking them folks... <laughs> Taking them folks' money, going over there, using them damn folks' money to take that trip. We ain't getting off of you chopping. We are not leaving you alone because you done took them folks' money and done took your whole family over there to have y'all a little excursion over in Honolulu. And that's ridiculous. And let me tell you guys, they should feel real stupid. Hello, uh purple sucking sucker suckers uh what is it purple sucking circle suckers you guys should feel real silly because i know you're over here honey she ain't on so come on over child and hit the like and subscribe button y'all while y'all coming in and on your way out and make sure you subscribe alley wishes in the bushes and the purple heart suckers too because you might want to stay like i say we're a little toxic but you're gonna love it over here more than you're gonna love it with her but anyway y'all she done took y'all money, little dummies, okay? <laughs> no, y'all ain't gonna stay now. She done took your money, and y'all sitting up here on the, on the big screen looking at her. You're looking at her. Doesn't taking people money look good? It's awful. You guys ought to be ashamed of yourself. You ought to be ashamed. You ought to feel less than a penny. That girl is over there on those boats on that. They they got the um, excursion um, trip. You know, the trip where it, it's a package. It all comes in a package. You take the little cheap boat ride and, you know, this, that, and that. And this. But like I say, and this neither near nor there, child. I ain't going to tear down. But you know I tear down and build it back up in the same breath. But y'all... It's good for her. It's good for her and her family. Because like I say, it's the first time for them going, all jokes aside, first time for her going. And um, that's good. You know, they're enjoying themselves, you know, and kudos to them. Good for them, child. But like I say, kudos to them and then the hell with them at the same time because they done set up. And I mean, honey, that little trip there, it wasn't cheap. Trust and believe me. The little trip ain't cheap, honey, okay? I don't know what airlines they went on, but when we flew, we ended up flying on American. So I don't know if they took the Hawaii Airlines or, or what, or a Southwest um, or what. I don't think uh, Spirit, <laughs> I don't think Spirit go. <laughs> I don't think Spirit can make it. I don't think Spirit do it, y'all. I haven't been in a minute, so I, I like I said, I haven't been in many years, so I don't know. And I'm pretty sure they have built up uh, Hawaii way more than when we was there. But this here was um, at uh, one of the places that we went uh, to eat, and it had just so many places to eat and so much desserts and. Oh, you would come back gaining so much weight. A soda in a can was shit. $5 at the time. You got to think that was back then. So it's, Hawaii is very expensive. Very, very expensive. So let me tell you, if she did not pack a good $6,000 going over there or more, uh, they are not going to enjoy themselves. It's a really expensive trip. I'm telling you, um, to take all those people that she took, I don't know. The girl could have been out about, ooh, she probably, y'all, she really got a good piece of change out them uh, Purple Heart sucking circles. She really did. That girl probably went over there probably with a good, I would say about eight or nine grand. She had to. I just, because I, I just can't see, you got to think she got to get the room. They're not cheap. You look where they were. They were at the penthouse. Oh, honey, she flung that, that money of them folks in their face. And the, the idiotic people 
loves it. They setting up here, oh, enjoy your trip, Ross. No, no, she using your money. Yeah, enjoy her trip. I'm pretty sure she will off of your expense. She's probably saying thank you guys all the way to Hawaii. You see that? Like some people say, thank you all the way to the bank. She's saying thank you all the way to her excursion with her family to Hawaii. She has really, really, um, She's showing you what you should, well, you can't be mad because she's showing you what you, what she's doing with it. What she is doing with y'all money, honey, as you can see, she is living her best life. She is doing shit that she has never thought in her life to do that. She, she never even phantom or, or thought that she could do these type of things. Her and her uh, grandchildren's and, 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 and son and, and daughter-in-law and all that, that there. Honey, this girl is living her best life. Do you hear me? Chopping is living her best life. And she is enjoying every uh, single bit of it off of you people's money. And you guys ought to be ashamed of yourself to sit back and be watching somebody having such a good time. And I'm pretty sure you was in the house probably eating uh, peanut, butter and <laughs> peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Uh, looking at her on the screen, just wishing and dreaming and hoping that you guys could maybe one day uh, go over there. And it's a shame because you could if you wouldn't have gave her your damn money. So look on. And I don't feel sorry for you. I don't feel sorry for none of you because you ought to been a shame. You need a whooping. Your folks need to come spank you. Okay, you need a good tail whooping for giving that girl all your damn mammy, your money. You need a whooping. I'm sorry. It just don't make no sense. But honey, her and her little children and all the grandchildren and all of them. Oh, honey, they over there doing things. And then she set up their child to come. I'm thinking this girl is really going to show folks a good time. I'm thinking, oh, I could have. I, I, really to tell you, I hate I didn't even drop some some dimes on her and let her know of uh, the places she could go and really have a good time. Child, that island was not it for her birthday. I'm sorry. I just if her, I mean they're 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 balling. They so big time. I would have just flew on over the mile with hell with it. Ain't no way I would have stopped at Waikiki over in Waikiki. Ain't no way. It's just no way I would have went to Oahu. But anyway, like I say, they don't know no better. They don't know nothing. And once you know better, you do better. So next time, like she said, I'm going to be taking many more. She's planning on getting many more of their money. So I'm pretty sure she will. And as long as those foolios want to continue to give them to them, I tip my hat to her. And I hope she enjoy Every time she go, I hope she enjoy herself because them fools need to be sitting back looking at somebody having a good time on their money. But I guess if you ain't going to have a good time on your money, somebody else sure in the same hell will. And as we can see, she is doing so. Okay. So we going to go home. We going <laughs> to go, go home. Excuse me. We going to go on. We going to go on down the road, honey, and give, and give Ra, um, uh, chopping rise all the hell with it. We're gonna go on down the road and give rise, uh, the damn championship, um, a trophy of the year. Okay, she gonna get the championship trophy of the year for money laundering, in my opinion. <laughs> I don't give a damn, she deserve it. She got away with it, she got away scot free with the bag, y'all. I mean, scot free. And when I say, in my opinion, she got away with the bag scot-free, she got away with that bag, in my opinion, scot-free. And I tip my damn stilettos to her, okay? So you can't be mad, everybody, honey. You just can't be mad. Like they say, honey, charge it to the damn game because she played them. Then she played them. She played them all the way to Hawaii, okay? Okay. So, y'all, now let's move it on on in this trip. Child, as last night, we saw her sitting up there at the table. I'm thinking they taking, they all up in there going in more damn black dresses like they going to a, a morning or a funeral. Ain't no way I would have wore no black dresses over in, I don't care if it was night. That is Hawaii. Okay, that is Hawaii. You don't wear no black dresses over in Hawaii. It's warm over there. Stays warm over there. It depends on what time and right, what season and what time. And right now, it's a nice warm uh, time of the year there. 
I wouldn't have wore black dresses. I would have wore something light and vibrant and 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 sunny and summery and 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 beautiful and beige and you know what I'm saying? They just you 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 can take folks out of somewhere. You just but you can't just take folks out of somewhere, child. You can take the girl out of Sacramento, but you can't take Sacramento uh wherever she's from up there in Brentwood. You can't take it out the girl. So anyway, they over there in black midnight look like uh what they call that after the funeral you go to a wake look like after the the party after party of a funeral dress is on child they over there and then they come out with this cake i'm thinking like okay they coming out with the cake she talking about her cake was gonna be so beautiful so beautiful i'm thinking oh honey they gonna bring a cake out y'all <clears throat> I'm thinking like this cake finna be so big and so nice and it's gonna have the the long stem uh candles that's going like fireworks, you know, like the little sparklers. I'm thinking they gonna have all those sticking around all in the cake because it's her 50th, right? I'm thinking it's gonna be like a little, little mini excursion. Honey, they come out with this little plain cake, look like a whole bunch of white dough dumped down on two round circles of cake with these little pretty purple flowers on the front which they should have continued the purple and went around the bottom of the cake with purple and up in the middle of the cake with purple and i would at least say happy birthday on the cake mom uh, happy birthday mom uh and had a big 50 big five O in gold you know big five, sparkly gold five O with a whole bunch of little uh candles on fire all over that that cake but y'all that's neither near nor there because they don't know maybe they'll know next time like i say, i'm just i'm just trying to help y'all i'm just trying to tell you what you should have done what you should have would have would have could have should have all of that that there honey that's all i'm just here to report i'm reporting on what you should have could have would have done okay so, y'all, they had the cake and all of that. Child, I'm thinking they're going to show us. Did they show us what they was eating? I don't even think I seen what they was eating. Did they get a big meal? But anyway, they got the package. <laughs> y'all, it just goes back to they got the Hawaiian excursion package. Okay, came with the whole, well, no, you, well, you can get it with the hotel. Like I say, the adventure, they go and show you do scuba diving. Then you get the, um, the, the the go down to the 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 place where you where they had that dinner party all of that you know it's just all lumped into one but like i say it wasn't cheap honey they paid a little little penny for it unless you got some discounts from a triple a a r a a r p i don't know i'm just i'm just throwing it out there i don't know i don't know i'm just saying but anyway look like she had a good time i'm so happy for her and her children, honey, that they went on this little excursion. It's so good. It's always good, you guys, uh, for black people to go places and to see things. Honey, try to get out and see things and go different pl places, my people. And enjoy yourself and have a good time. Because she really looked like she was having a good time. And I'm happy for her. But in a, in a sense, I'm, well, you know what I am happy for. I ain't going to sit up here and try to fake it a lot. I'm happy for the gal. I'm glad that she over there and enjoying herself because I am. I it, it, it ain't no need for me to be mad at nobody because them damn fools gave her their money. So why are we gonna be mad? We should be tipping our hats to her ass because she done made, like I said, she done made the biggest getaway of the year. She need a trophy. Somebody ought to be printing her up a trophy right now, sending it to her with slick Rick on the front running with a with a money bag like they running that's what in my opinion that's what the hell she needs y'all it's just the truth i mean i'm here to tell the truth nothing but the truth and that's just that okay so we can't be mad at her so i'm sorry sister sucking circle she done got you she done clipped you honey and y'all sitting here looking at her having her good time with her family off of y'all checkbook okay okay poor little tank tanks i don't feel sorry for you but anyway y'all so she's showing us all this and then this is what i don't understand and this is what i don't like this is just me i don't know if anybody else feel like it but this is how i feel what every time somebody come on these folks always asking folks where they get shit from they up there asking that girl what she got that old cheap mm, 
a leopard damn bonnet on her head from. I'm going, go to the damn store and buy you one. They sell them all day, girl. You can get them at Target at the damn half supply. Child, go buy you one. Quit asking folks where they get old, old nonsense stuff from. A damn bonnet. You know where you get a bonnet from? That goes to show you they the biggest fools in the world. Anybody asking somebody where they get a damn bonnet from? They got bunnies standing on the cone all kinds. Child, go on Amazon. You can get one. Do you know anything about that? Or are you just stupid all the way around? Oh, my goodness. I was so irritated by that. I said, oh, my goodness, child. I said, oh, it just took me back to my auntie. Oh, just so silly. Just silly. I just started saying that to myself. I said, oh, they're so silly. Who asks, who asks somebody where they get a damn bonnet from? Come on, sister sucking circle. Get it together, people. Because I know it was her people. That's how much up in her uh, behind that they are. They, it's, 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 uh, it's foolish. So foolish. And I was just outdone. I was outdone. I said, honey, I have seen it all. A damn bunny. Where, where you get that bunny from, Rye? Where you get that bunny from? Where you get that from? Where you get them shoes from? Oh, that's a pretty dress. Where you get that dress from? Oh, that's pretty hair. Where you get the hair from? And speaking of hair, she lying. There she go lying again, y'all. Talking about, oh, y'all now I'm going to take care of my hair. Girl, that is not your hair. Stop it. We done seen your little thin, brittle hair. Your hair cannot hold a curl that deep waved if you was to put some paste on it and put some damn sponge rollers in it and left it overnight. Girl, <laughs> and lie to them about this old damn front lace wig. And you know it's a front lace. You know good and doggone well that's a front lace. That is not your hair. Talking about, oh, y'all know I'm going to take care of my hair. I'm sitting up here with my one eye cocked and the other one scooch. And I said, do this girl think that we just some straight out, just down home right damn fools? She know good and damn Sam Willie well that this is not her hair. I'm going like, oh my goodness, here she go with another one. I just couldn't believe it. I just couldn't believe it, child. With that all that baby hair, we know she ain't even got no edges. Girl, bye. Girl, bye. You ain't even got no edges to make no curls around the front like that. Anybody get a front lace? The first and listen, while I'm talking, y'all know I'm here to teach, child. I'm here to teach, honey. Y'all know. Hit that like button, y'all. Make sure y'all run it up, honey. Like, subscribe, and share. I need 500 more subscribers, child. Come on and do that. Put it up there, child, and I can come on more and more. Do all of that that there for me. But anyway, y'all, now listen here. <sighs> that good at anybody, you guys, anybody, this is what I want my people to stop doing. When y'all get them front laces, please, y'all, for me, please, the one that does this, stop making them little squiggly, squiggly uh, 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 hair bangs in the front, that baby hair that we know that you ain't got. You don't even look like your hair baby up like that around the damn edges. Stop it. That is why it's called baby hair. It's for babies. Okay? It's for babies. <laughs> It's not for adults. I can see if you put a little, you know, a little brush out, a little, a little hair here and there. But all them big old squirrelies, come on now. Come on. All these little things shaped like an S and a U and a L and a V and a W, X, Y, Z. Stop. Just stop. Just stop for goodness gracious. Just stop it for old time state. Stop. Okay, get your nice little front lace, make it straight or curly, whatever, and just bring out your just a couple of little strings in the front to make you look pretty. You know how your mom make your baby have you listen say, oh, now you're pretty. <laughs> just make you look cute a little bit. But all that old extra newborn baby shit you got around there, and we know you ain't got no edges. Girl, bye. Go sit down somewhere. I'm tired of it now, y'all. Stop it. It looks bad. It looks bad on us. Stop. 
that's just that's just what I'm just just something I just want to throw out there for everyone who didn't know. Now you know, like I said, you're gonna learn over here today. But honey, there she go with that damn front lace claiming that it is her hair. And we know it is not her hair. It's too thick and full. And it was a nice little front lace. Don't get me wrong. And she ought to keep it on. And whoever put it on there, they put it on because they made it look like it was her hair. And we, like I say, but we know better because we the smart group over here. And we know good and damn, damn right that that is not her hair. And them folks on there talking about, oh, your hair. Oh, your hair. Oh, what you going to do with your hair? I said, oh, she got the right folks. Y'all scratching my nose right now, as I said, she got the right damn folks. She deserve them. Y'all, she deserved them fools, okay? Then what you call some straight fools. Do you hear me? It's ridiculous. And they ought to feel bad. And if they got any family, if y'all, let me tell you, anybody out here that got family that's in this sister sucking, sucking circle, go get them. Y'all, go get them. And when you get them, you whoop them. <laughs> whoop they ass. For me, because they ought to be ashamed. They just they they silly. They some silly little gooses. They study telling that oh your hair, your hair so pretty. Oh I like your hair. What you gonna do? What you put in it? What's that? What's that in your hair? Oh I love it. Oh your hair. Oh I said I can't do it. I just had to turn it off, y'all. I couldn't watch it anymore. I just couldn't. I said this here is unbelievable. I mean when I say they run a mat up and down that goes behind and slide up and down her ass it's ridiculous and that is what they do it's terrible it's sad for grown-ups to act and do some of the things that they do it's it's really really pitiful but you guys i just said honey i i, I couldn't go another day i know it's sunday and i usually don't come on on sunday but honey I couldn't go, I couldn't go another day without reporting on that situation that I saw on this little damn uh, remedial uh, excursion that she has taken her children on. But like I say, I hope she have a good time and enjoy themselves. And she looked like she is. She looked peaceful and she looked like, you know, she's really enjoying herself. And that's good, you know, because she, I guess she ain't being bothered by going back and forth on the thing. But what she needs to do it's just stop answering. As she can see why she over here, do she see that people is going to do what they going to do regardless what she say something back or not? So this ought to show her to just move on. If she move on, I think everybody else would. I think we will all just move on because, um, I, I mean, come on, she on this my, oh, I, um, I'm not going to go on because I figure if I don't go on and this, that, and that, and this, you're not going to stop anything. I mean, people are still going to talk about who they're going to and what they want to talk about, whether you peep your head out and say something here or, and there. They're going to still get you. But, you know, like I say, if I think if you wanted to end it uh, chopping, you knew how you would know how because it's been kind of quiet over the weekend on uh, since you've been gone. And I believe if you wanted to really, really stop the madness, you could do so. But I don't think you you want to because you want another trip. OK, uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, I said it. You want another trip. You want another trip. You got to finish paying the car and you want to do some other things you have never done in your life. Um, so I guess uh, in order to do that, you have to roll with the flow and go with the punches and the punches require that uh, you go back and forth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You in the YouTube Illuminati. Yes, you are. Uh-huh. Yeah. So anyway, y'all, <laughs> this girl here, this woman here, this woman here is just a fraud and a fake and a phony and all that there above, child, it's just a mess. Now, y'all watch. Y'all just sit here and watch. When she come back, she going to call herself, going to have some content and try to get on money short. And nobody should even watch her ass. Nobody should even watch her because I know money short. Glad she gone because she ain't bothering her. I know she glad that her behind is gone on this trip. One very well needed and deserved for. Because maybe she will clear her mind and come back and do something else. Some more content. But we know she can't. Because without uh, the people out here on these YouTube Scarface uh, uh, streets, you know, 
uh, she she wouldn't be able to survive in life because for one, Tommy ain't got a job in my opinion. For number two, she's doing things that she has never dreamed in her life, even when she was a child. <laughs> even when she was a damn child that she could do so honey she is living her damn bestest okay so hey she's gonna keep doing uh what she do and and these people get on my nerves forever leave her alone y'all stop y'all do this child go sit down somewhere and continue to get her all y'all damn paycheck because ain't nobody stopping she ain't gonna stop because she likes the drama y'all like the drama because y'all keep coming back talking and listening and commenting on it go sit down with y'all little tricky asses too y'all in that purple heart sucking circle miserable and messy as well try to play like you ain't but I'm on the other hand on the outside looking in and can see that you really are. You just as fake and fraudulent as she is, in my opinion. Okay? So all y'all just ought to go all throw the whole damn channel, sister circle channel away. Because, child, y'all ain't right. <clears throat> but anyways, I said, honey, let me go on and report this damn uh, trip that this girl here done, um, done took. And done made it. She done hyped us up like she going on this big old holly wally uh, uh, down. Oh, honey, I thought she was going down under. The way, oh, we're going to make trip. I'm getting, oh, we've been shopping. Oh, we've been, you. what you shopping for? I ain't seen you nothing but in that one uh, Honolulu dress you done wore. You done had on at the dinner party. You had one on when you got there in the hotel. I mean, I seen you in your gown. What did you go buy? Chopping. What did you go buy? I didn't see nothing. You you never would show us your full body. So what did you go shop for? You didn't have a bathing suit? I would think everybody had a bathing suit. That goes to show you, like I say, y'all, the hillbillies went to Hawaii, period. Okay? That's just that. The hillbillies went to Hawaii because that's just what they remind me of. Jeff Rowe, Lillian, and whoever and all of them. <laughs> did I say Jeff Rowe? Jeff Rowe shit and all of them. It just don't make no sense, y'all. But child, they went on over there and they they there. And she said they'll be back on Monday and this, that, and all of that. But that's a good little vacation for them. And they done did all that and good for them. So child, that's just that. But I said, let me come on and report real quick. I wasn't going to hold y'all long this evening. I told you, usually, honey, I'm long-winded and I keep you on here for hours and hours, but honey, I'm going to go on and let you go early tonight for y'all can go on and watch a uh, storyteller from the, from the crypt and all of that. Cause she, all she do is put on stories and uh story time and all of that. Cause she do have, cause her, her damn mouth is a story book. Let me tell it. It is a story book. I'm telling you, the girl got some stories for your behind. Okay. She going to come back. Oh, we just had a, Oh, 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 we had a great time. Oh, it was so beautiful. Oh, and they did. Oh, my kids, and they did. Oh, they did that. Oh, they put this on for me. Oh, the girl, please, you paid for it. Your kids didn't do anything. You paid for it. You took all of them over there, okay? You took them all over there. Stop it. Stop it trying to make it seem like you guys are Beaver Cleaver family. Knock it off. And they send them people, oh, you guys got such a beautiful family. Oh, I just love your family. Oh, and your family is just so, you miserable sucking circle people. Go get you a family for you can be uh, thankful. And I'm pretty sure you got some folks. Go fool with them. Go hang out with them. Make you up a trip. Go to lunch with them. You can have you one too and quit dwelling on somebody else. I can't stand somebody that's always fiending as we used to say back in the day fiending over another person's stuff stop it <laughs> just stop because you sound awful you just sound just like what you are sister sucking foolish circle okay okay so y'all, honey, I'm so glad y'all done came in here, honey. My tea hives, I just love you. Hello, my beautiful tea hives. Those are my subscribers. If you would like to become a member, okay, you can go ahead and get your membership over there. Go on over there and look it up and see, and you can be a member. 
honey one of these tea hives out here and you can just have all kind of little perks and your name put up and this and that and seeing me and this and all we're gonna do all of that honey don't worry i'm gonna come out piece by piece but anyway go on and join y'all i just love you guys i really really do I thank you guys for coming over here, uh, supporting me, watching me, and all of that there, honey. And I just, I'm going to be on this week. I'm going to do a live for sure. And I would hope and expect you guys come through, honey, come through and show out and make sure you stay to the end, okay? If you are my subscribers, stay and watch me. I don't care who coming on and who on. You are my subscribers. So if you are my subscriber, you stay over here and watch me, okay? Until I get off and you catch they replay. I think that's how it's supposed to go, right? Because like I say, I don't care who you go watch. You just stay here and watch me and wait till I'm done. Then you go on and do what you do. I just think that's the that's the respectful thing to do, right? I'm not asking for too much from y'all, but I know my subscribers do. I think that be them other folks. But anyway, like I say, child, that's neither near nor there, honey. But anyway, I just love you guys. Thank you for coming on and watching me on this Sunday evening. You guys enjoy the rest of your evening, honey. And if you can't, don't you go mess of nobody else's don't go calling start no mess tonight go to bed you got a free day tomorrow i think it's a holiday it's a lincoln's day or whatever school is out for these children so honey y'all enjoy y'all day and get ready for valentine's day honey get the men some things uh try to get your trip set up and i'm gonna come back and chit chat we're gonna talk about that too but until then i just love you guys enjoy your evening and until next time peace